Hey guys, Eric here. There's a lot that I love about the MSP community, but there's one thing I really don't. So it pops up from time to time, and I'm not going to say that it's a pervasive problem. It's not something that I see every day. But every once in a while, and I've seen it recently, where we're very critical of others in the MSP community, either because they don't subscribe to the same business model uh, that we do, you know, say we're doing fully managed and they're still doing break fix, um, or they're using a certain type of equipment and we're using a certain type of equipment. Um, it, there was a very interesting poll that came up um, where people were asking about different types of laptops. It's very hard to go manufacturer by manufacturer and say these are bad or these are good. Um, but people get very polarized in their opinions on these things and I just don't think it's healthy for the community at large. Now, for an example, there's a lot of things that we would consider best practices out there. But sometimes those best practices don't fit within the requirements or for the certain customer that an IT service provider may be working with. And I'll give you an example. So we used to talk about patch management a lot and patch management can be different. The requirements and the specifications that are put on when and how you can do patch may be different across different clientele. And so for that reason, you can't really define a best practice that works for the entire industry. You can sketch some very broad strokes, but you can't get specific about patch management because the clients are very, very different. And that brings me to my next point, diversity. We don't just have diversity in our business models and the types of equipment we like to use. Our clients are hugely, hugely diverse. Some of us are dealing with residential, some of us are dealing with high-end residential, some with small businesses, some with medium-sized businesses, and some even larger MSPs are dealing with enterprise level customers. And that means that the requirements and the tolerances are going to be different across all of those different customers. The budgets are going to be different. The compliance requirements are going to be different. So when we start talking about doing certain things certain ways, um, let's just be a little more tolerant of how we treat others and what they're doing with their specific clients. All right, guys, thanks for letting me uh, have that little rant. Uh, I hope that this just kind of makes everybody think a little bit more uh, before they type something or share something on social media that uh, might be viewed as critical. We just have to remember that we all come from different places and that we all have different situations and different customers. Thanks a lot. Let's crush this thing. See ya. You thought I forgot, didn't you? Nope. If you like this video, go ahead and click like. If you dislike this video, go ahead and hit that button as well. But you know the rules. You have to comment down below why you didn't like the video so I can improve future ones. Click that subscribe button to make sure that uh, you're notified when I release new videos. Oh, wait, that's what the bell is for. So subscribe and then ring the bell to be notified. Thanks again. Let's crush this thing. See ya.